Hello, people of the internet. My name is Johnny, and welcome back to Five Nights with... Come on, make it Mac tonight. Welcome back to Five Nights with Mac tonight. I am recording this immediately after the first episode because I enjoyed this game so much. This time, including Mac tonight, we now have to take care of the ham burglar. The ham burglar is a small animatronic, allowing him to fit into the vent. Once he is in the vent, triggered by a bang sound, use the vent heater to get rid of him. So, that's going to be a new mechanic that we have to deal with. The vent, as well as the mechanics for... I, uh, excuse me, Mac tonight. I apologize for that. That was disgusting. Alright, I don't know where the vent is. Hover over the... Yes, okay, we know that. Is this the thing? That is the thing. Okay, so, it appears that I can only use it in cam 8, which is interesting. Um, I can only use the heater in cam 8, which is weird because my office is like cam 0, zero. at least I think. I'm not sure, because it never tells me where I am located. But yes, okay, Mac tonight is coming after me, he's starting his treacherous journey and I have no clue where the hamburglar starts off so I just uh, actually I could probably look for him I don't see him though I saw Mac tonight in what I think was cam 6 though now he's in cam 3 Jesus okay okay I don't know if the vent leads straight into my office or like I said if it leads straight into cam 8. I guess we'll find out once we hear the bang noise. Hey, I don't feel safe. I'm gonna do that and do that. I don't know what they said. I don't really wanna know. I don't even know who that was. Oh my god. God, I don't even know where Mac is now. I don't even know where the Hamburglar starts off. I'm in a bit of a pickled situation. Does <laughs> Got him. For the great taste. Dinner at McDonald's. It's Mac tonight! Come on, make it Mac tonight! Don't leave that in. <laughs> what the? Oh! Oh! I didn't notice him there. Wait, wait, has he always been there? What the freak? Oh, jeez. I have not been looking after Mac tonight. Oh, you! <laughs> I did not hear any bang noise! Ah, oh, you... Mmm, you suck. For the great taste. I wonder if that... Hmm. I wonder if that's the Hamburglar spawning in. Eh? Eh? Maybe? Probably not, but maybe. Also, I don't know where Mac is, so I may be boned. No, I'm good. Alright, I see him going into the vent. I'm gonna be quiet. That's lightning. Maybe it wasn't lightning. What? Hey? Alright, so that's him. So he's here now. I'm gonna try something new, okay? Since I apparently don't hear the bang sound, I don't know, maybe it was the thunder. That doesn't work, okay. That was my idea was whenever I see him going into the vent, use the heater then. Who knows, maybe I'm just stupid. I really want to listen for this banging sound. 
Yeah, there's no banging sound. <laughs> what the heck? Is that... That's him. What was that, Cam Sex? He's... Okay. Confused for a while. Actually, now I'm very confused. So, he's in Camp 6. Then he moves to Camp 7 when he talks. I was in Camp 8, except he didn't say a thing. So, when he's in that phase and I do that, it doesn't get rid of him. I'm just gonna constantly spam this. I, I have him just on by himself. Like, I don't, I don't have Mac tonight on any difficulty he's set on zero, and the Hamburglar's on 20. So, is that the noise? I don't even know who I got killed by. I didn't see. Is that the noise? I think that's the noise. Whoa, you went to camp one to six in like two seconds. Not even. I was in camp seven without making any noise. Okay. Now we, um, no. Okay, camp eight now. So, um, you just saw me get rid of Mac tonight. I shouldn't have to explain this, but I have both them on set I have both of them on set on 20. I have both of them set on 20. Max Knight shouldn't be a... So it's the next phase I do it. Did I, did I do it? I did it. I got rid of him. So that lightning strike that sounds like a lightning strike is actually the vents. You are telling me that a lightning strike sounds the same as an animatronic in a ventilation shaft. Okay, sure. That's the- oh my god, that actually is- him in the vents, the lightning strike. You could just say, when he's in the vents, cued by the lightning strike. But no, by a bang noise. I'm expecting that to sound like the traditional someone's in the vents FNAF sound. Not a freaking lightning strike. I realize I'm probably criticizing this a bit too much, but I was expecting that. Not a lightning strike. Full gray taste. I, ba I basically called it. Probably shouldn't do that because there is a cooldown to the heat and the speaker. So I probably. Probably shouldn't do that, but you know, whatever. Where is Mac, by the way? I haven't seen him in a little bit. There we go, Cam 5. Alright, cool. It's 4 a.m. Um, I haven't really been doing much talk in this round. Just because this is the first round where I fully understand what both the characters do. Good example. Thanks, Mac. So I, I kind of just want to get this done here. 5 a.m., let's do it. Yeah, I kind of just want to get this done and see who the next character is. I'm thinking... Alright, my guess is it's going to be Grimace. Because he's just kind of chilling out. Same room as the Hamburglar. And I have no other reason. That is just my guess. I would like to see other people like Ronald and... um Some other characters. I don't know. I did see that there were like two rows and then another one or two at the bottom. So there's 
there's quite a few characters in this game. And I'm pretty intrigued to see, I guess you could say, who they are. I nearly hit the speaker, and that would have been very bad. Because it would have had to recharge. That's a weird thing to say about a speaker. It would have had to um, finish its cooldown, and I would have been dead. I wouldn't have time to hit it again. So it's a good thing I didn't do that. That's that's one thing I need to get used to is not hitting the buttons just randomly. Because like I said, you know, there's a cooldown and that cooldown can really mess you up sometimes. Alright, we should... There we go. I was about to say, we should be getting pretty close to six. Who did we unlock? I'm calling it now. It's gonna be Grimace. Hey, it just fell down on my keyboard. Who is it? Ronald Mick freaking Donald. Ronald can only access your doorway to the right side of the office. Like Max and I use the speakers in Max's stage camera to lure him there. Due to no eyes, hearing is his only way to keep him move around. Or to help him move around. That's not that bad, actually. However, something I did notice is that the more characters you have on, the longer the night is. When you have one character, it's 45 minutes. You have two, it's 125. And then, when you have three, it's 145. Or maybe it's not... I don't know. Two is definitely 125, three is 145, and then one character is... It is 45, okay. So if I have all three of them on, it's gonna be nearly two minutes per hour. But, luckily I don't have to worry about that right now, because this is the end of the episode. So thank everyone so much for watching, leave a like if you want to see more Mac tonight, and I'll see you all on the flip side. Goodbye!